Tex. I gotta get aboard and stop those cars before they hit the bridge. Carter's responsible for this. I'm going to town and settle with him. I'm aiming to get him before you do. Jim! Tex! That gal. We got no time for her now. Over here! Help me! Boy, you spoiled a fine killer for me by being alive. Yeah, he interfered with my collecting King Carter scalp. Listen, it's a good thing for you fellas that I am alive. You might have lost your own. Well, I don't understand how you men can take these things so lightly. Well, as long as you got to take them, that's the only way to do it. After all, boys, the loss of that bridge is serious. It means a complete change in plans. We got to go report to Mr. Hartford right away. It's all good, Carter. Except Jeff Ramsey got away safe. I get one chance at him, but that Hartford girl get in way. I was right, Snake Eye. The girl mustn't be harmed. And you'll get plenty of chances to finish off Ramsey. With that bridge destroyed, they can't bring up any more supplies by rail. But now that we've cut the telegraph, they may try to send somebody to the stage, so keep your eyes open. Necessary supplies if you will suggest any way for me to get back. Well, the stage always gets through. It's due here from the east today and goes back tomorrow. I'll take it. Well, I'd suggest an armed escort. That'll not be necessary. Besides, we can't spare the man. Right, you're the boss. I'll go with you, Dad. Oh, no, no, dear. It's too risky. Oh, I don't mind the risk. I don't want to stay here alone. If uh, Miss Hartford wants to go, I'd suggest that you take her. Thank you. Don't mention it. Brian can keep the men busy filling in and tamping the road bed until the new supplies arrive. While I'm back there, I'll speak to the commandant at Fort Custer and see if we can get some military protection. You'll definitely go on the stage. Definitely. Pick six good men for that armed escort tomorrow. We're liable to run into trouble. I could use a little excitement. I sure found the place where that white man who bosses the engines hides out. Boy, if we could only catch him and prove that Carter's responsible, we'd have him right where we want him. Then let's get going. It's a long ride. Wait. Check with the stage driver about Mr. Hartford going east tomorrow. Don't forget your girlfriend. How oh, can I? I hope she never comes back. <laughs> Hi, Lacey. They tell you about picking up Mr. Hartford tomorrow? Yep, I won't forget. Have any trouble with Indians? Nope, they don't trouble me none. Take care of me. Hello, Lacey. Just in time to join me. Bye. Shot of whiskey. Too many passengers? Nope. 
But I'm taking two mighty important ones east tomorrow. That's so? Who are they? Well, the president of this year railroad needed order. They don't say. They going all the way east? Nope, just first Fort Custer. Well, I hope you don't have any Indian trouble. Ha <laughs> ha. Indians don't bother me none. Here's to your health, Mr. Carter. Drink hearty. <laughs> Hartford's going to Fort Custer for troops. When? Tomorrow on the stage. Get Snake Eye on the job at once. Tell him to take the girl to War Eagle's village. Maybe I can stage a thrilling rescue and become her noble protector. Women don't belong in this business. But if they insist on entering it... Then they should be treated exactly as any other enemy. Just over that rise. Let's take a look. Sneak up on him. Come on. Maybe you'll answer a few questions. Why in thunder didn't you let me plug him? You could have plugged yourself with that hand. But at that, I'd like to send him on that stage tomorrow with Hartford. Let the boys kind of work on it. Yeah, and I'd like to have sent him some other place and let somebody else work on it. <laughs> Come on, let's get out of here. Now, don't worry, dear. There isn't any danger. The stage has never been attacked. 
Buffalo meat. Gee, what I wouldn't give for a steak off of one of them critters. We got more important things to do on that, Tex. You're always spoiling my eats. How far are we going to ride, Jeff? Well, just far enough to make sure the stage is out of danger. If I was an engine, I'd pick bolt or cut to jump the stage. Hey, maybe you're right at that, Tex. Let's head for there. Still over Stone Canyon? Well, it's the last time I took notice. What's on your mind? Try to sneak across it, pick up an Indian pony, and get back to camp for help. You're right. Those devils will keep us here till we starve to death. Let's get going. We might make it. 